this has been an amazing journey. And while God may be a God of second chances, at times voters are a little bit less forgiving. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, in that regard, it has been an amazing journey. And so I want to thank each one of the voters here in the first district of South Carolina for what they've done to propel our campaign and the ideas that it's been based on. I want to thank again so many different volunteers who backed in to get that word out. But at the end of the day, the voter makes a verdict in elections. And I thank them for this verdict that they've uncovered uh, or laid out here. Uh, I guess part of it is to say that we could be in the Republican nominee in advancing conservative ideas here in this first congressional district race. Yes. And if we make it in May, ultimately a messenger of important conservative ideas in this national debate that's before us. Yes. And, uh, <laughs> and I will simply go back to where I began, which is to say that I'm incredibly humbled, incredibly gratified, incredibly um, thankful for this night, for what it means at many different levels, and I just want to thank every one of you for your part in making it possible. Thank you very, very much. Thank you.